the primary differences are 100% uh, carbon free by 2040 in her case, 2050 in my case. That's Corporation Commissioner Leah Marquez Peterson debating what's next for Arizona's renewable energy standards. She has interim targets that I'm not comfortable with. It's all been a part of learning on the job. Marquez Peterson, a Republican, was appointed by Governor Ducey in May of 2019 after he assigned former Commissioner Andy Tobin to a different state agency. We have some pretty different ideas on how we can achieve clean energy and zero carbon emission in the state of Arizona. Now the Tucson native and former head of the Tucson Hispanic Chamber of Commerce is running as a clean elections candidate to get the seat on her own accord. Yesterday we approved an energy efficiency program for APS that had been sitting in backlog for more than uh, two and a half years. She says the commission hears 70 to 80 rate cases a year including the current APS rate case in which they're asking for a $184 million rate hike. I asked how she balances ratepayers' desire not to raise rates with the requirement that utilities make a profit. It's just a conversation, I think, with the ratepayer so that they fully understand that this is, it, it's like a, a three-legged stool. We need reliability, we need sustainability, and we need affordability. So it's a balance. It's a balance, she says, requires more communication between the commission and ratepayers from more public sessions to making the website less complicated. You really got to know how the system works to find the information you're looking for. I think we could do better. Courtney Holmes, ABC 15, Arizona.